To me, there's nothing more humbling than the power of the open ocean and being out there in a relatively tiny vessel surrounded by nothing. And I think probably one of the most special moments is when you're able to shut off the diesel engine and that low grumble stops and all of a sudden you're surrounded by silence, excepting for the sound of the wind in the sails and the sound of the ocean and the waves lapping on the hull. I used to live in New York, but I found that my life there was very much ungrounded. It's often difficult to see or understand your own connection to the natural world when you're surrounded by the concrete jungle. After leaving New York, I moved to Vargas Island in Clackwood Sound, which is a UNESCO biosphere reserve and one of the most abundant and diverse ecosystems in the world. The experience of living off-grid helped me develop a much deeper understanding of my own dependence on ecological health. I decided that I wanted to facilitate similar experiences for others. And so I came up with the idea of creating an ecological field station in Clackwood Sound. The idea of creating Cedar Coast Field Station stemmed from the desire to live this lifestyle of off-grid living while contributing to society in a meaningful way. The aim of the Cedar Coast Field Station is to preserve ecological health through place-based research and education that celebrates the cultural and biological diversity of Clackwood Sound. In practice, we are providing a space where researchers and education groups can stay and learn from the local ecology. This is an area of bogs, which is a very specific group of plants that can live in this acidic soil. Stunted shore pines are the dominant tree species. Here you can feel that the earth is alive. We are part of this ocean. We need to encourage the governments to put more strict regulations on the use of plastic in marine industries like fishing and aquaculture. I truly believe that we will not fight to save what we do not love, and we will not love something without first having a personal connection to it.